Hello guys, I am going to work on some of my um these things. I thought I would film some of what I did. I found this fabric. It's got little dog paws on them. Print. I like the colors so first. After I washed it, I am now going to iron it flat. Okay. So I'm going to grab my iron. Also, all these sharpies I'm going to use to um, trace out. Okay, so I'm just going to splash it. I'm just using my uh, phone camera. It usually says YouTube capture when I use my phone in the description. Okay. You can see my green screen. <laughs> I really need a room. Put my green screen in so I don't just hang it on the wall. Some water on the screen. Some squares I've already cut. Some pink ones. I really like this color. I actually got a couple of the pink ones. All the pink ones done. I really like this color. This color together for me. And I got the kiss ones. The kiss on it. That's about all I've gotten done the new one, so. Then my stabilizer. It's a lot of cutting. Here's my pattern, but this one might not be the right one, so I gotta get the right one. Okay, you want the smaller one for the pattern. And I just cut this out of my cardboard. And then I just lay it on here, and I try to get as many as I can on this thing. It's actually going to be long ways, so the pattern maybe I should turn it like that, like that, because. going to be
gonna turn this around so I don't work on the front. Just crawling up again. cardboard piece of paper thing and they are going to get across that's about good right here that's good so I'm going to take the sharpie I guess a black would work. I could have just used my other one, but it's not my other one. Let's go with purple. I think purple will definitely show up when I chase this. So. I wish I had a stand for this, because I could probably get a better angle. just want to go ahead and go around it. Flex, so... And this is what I need to do for, I want to try making a quilt, so, for my nephew. I'm going to cut out a bunch of squares. Try to do that. Okay, so, try to get three out of here. get three <clears throat> barely I don't know if I'm going to be able to up here oh, right here it's just like a little gold name right there It's quite relaxing when I get it all chased out. I can just sit down and watch YouTube or a movie and cut it out. That's kind of time consuming though because you need one of these, one of these, and then one of these to make one. I try to cut a lot of them at once. See so right here has the writing, so if that shows up, I'll just go ahead and keep it for myself or give it away or something. Because I don't want the writing on there. I can line that up in the middle. There we go. I really like these fine tip sharpies to do this because it sure gets it nice and accurate and uh, precise. And you can't see this when I done with it, so it's okay. I can get, I think I'm going to be able to get at least a nine on here in this piece. going to use my other camera but I have people coming over to fix to look at something to fix and I didn't want to take move everything in here because 
my ceiling needs fixed, so they're coming over today. And I decided I would just use my phone. Okay. Did it film this? I don't know. The sound's probably not the greatest. I think for, um, okay, so that's done. I'll show you. You can see better. I don't know. Well, you can kind of see. Right here. Okay. So this is the pattern. So I could use red. For the border, it's got red in it, or I could probably, probably do black, I'm thinking, I do black, and see how it turns out, so, I usually do quite a few of these, and then I start cutting, My scissors and I'll pick out my scissors. My pink scissors. Alright, so what I do? My heat just kicked on, so. Okay, what I do is I just cut as close as I can. Oops. To the line. Okay. And then I really need to get a stand for my iPhone 6. I don't know if they make them or not, but that would be cool. Let's grab this one cut. Let's see. on and on but voila and it would go to the other wait let me see which I will say out oh I thought it would go there so it's going to go like that it's going to be like that doggy print one okay. so I'm going to add this to the pile so I got uh, actually it's kind of cool with the pink border 
I don't think I have any more pink, but that's kind of neat. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut one more and probably end this video. I don't know if you can hear the cutting so well or not, but. Dog. My mom and I are doing a craft show this month. So that ought to be fun. As I was saying, this one right here, as I said, has the writing on it, so if it doesn't turn out, I just keep it or give it away, but I don't like to waste the fabric, so it doesn't really bother me, and I want to make, start making, um, makeup bags or pencil bags when I get done with making all of these on some cute fabric that might look pretty good with the makeup bags the makeup bags with a zipper like this. I should do zippers on. So I'm going to make the bags like this. This is the first one I tried to do a quilting bag. It's not the best but it didn't turn out too bad. The zipper looks nice, and then I did the quilting on it. Kind of looks like a pillow. It's nice and soft, though. Okay. So, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later.